Either way, not sure I'm a fan. Great, let's spring. Just a second, kids. Now choose. Who wants their heart changed first? Don't do it, Akane! Whoa, Gramps? <laughs> he escaped the police after all! What are you doing here? Guys, we came to help! Oracle! I can hardly believe it! Good going, Oracle. I knew you'd come. You are Akane, right? <sighs> Just stop this. None of them did anything wrong. If you're willing, we can talk this out. Talk it out? With you? <laughs> Listen to me just this once. You're right. I couldn't catch the person who took your mother's life. I understand why you'd want nothing to do with a father who kept his head down and took it. But if you don't snap out of it, they're gonna get you too. Now wake up! Say you couldn't catch him? It's more like you didn't want to catch him. That monster who killed Mom. You knew it was Awada. Awada? As in Awada the legislator? One of the masterminds we seek? in her heart. And if you do nothing, she'll never move past it. <sighs> After your mom died, I was taken off the case. They reasoned that a family member couldn't judge impartially. Soon after, that secretary ended his own life, leaving behind a note saying he was the one responsible. No one else spoke up to contradict that. To the police, it seemed like solid proof. Eventually, they concluded the secretary was at fault and left it at that. To them, the case was as good as closed. Akane, when you told me what really happened, I knew that note was fake. So without skipping a beat, I opened up my own investigation. But no matter what I found as proof, it'd get wiped one way or another before I could bring it to light. So you gave up, right? Your sense of justice sure didn't get you very far. Akane... I made a promise to Aoi that I'd protect you, no matter what the case. What? At that point, you were my only reason to live. I didn't want to lose more family, so I promised Aoi I'd never let anything happen to you, even if it killed me. Saying that doesn't change anything. One day, I received a threat letter in the mail, telling me to either stop my investigation or my daughter dies. What? How could they? That's when I realized there was definitely evil in this world. And in the end, one man is nothing compared to the forces of darkness. Gramps. I will never forgive Owada, even though I can't lay a finger on him. If it weren't for my current boss, I'd still be wallowing in despair. I decided I'd do whatever it takes to help her reach the top. All the while thinking it was the only way to protect Akane and honor Aoi's memory. And I was even prepared to use all of you without a second thought. Sankichi. <laughs> Akane-chan. See? You hear that just now? He's nothing but a scheming manipulator. As long as he gets his way, he'll hang you all out to dry. How could you say that? Did you not get that he's been trying to keep you safe? I know what he was trying to do, but to do it, Values as an officer. Akane. If it was only us, I'd get it. We're family. Mom would think so too. But what about the secretary who died? Did you ever stop to think what his family's going through? Not only did they lose a loved 
loved one. They have moths that hanging over their heads. Did you forget that? Or did you choose to forget on purpose? Uh, I had no idea you were thinking of them. You're just like the trash who killed mom. Pretending nothing ever happened. I'm like Owada? You and the police just sit on your asses all day, letting the bad guys roam free. You people can't save anyone. I can. I'm the only one who cares. I'll change that evil bastard's heart so Mom can rest in peace. Uh. I'll beat down every last villain in this world. Connie Chun. Is this why you became a monarch? Because I sacrificed others to keep what little family I have alive? Was I wrong? This whole time and this is all my doing. You're like this because of me. Zenkichi. It's true. I used whoever I could as long as my daughter was safe. It didn't matter what anyone else suffered. What else was I supposed to do? I was trying to protect my family. It's what anyone would have done. Anyone! Anyone but a man of justice. Who's there? Are you sure you weren't at fault? Who's talking to me? You knew what it would cost to give up your chase. Yet you fled from the truth. Convinced yourself that it's right and just. With your daughter's name hollow upon your lips. You are as guilty as those you hate. A foul villain, rotten to the core. That's... No, I... You traded away the justice you built. You bought your comfort, bribed your guilt. <laughs> Senkichi? Senkichi, what happened? Snap out of it! He's right. It's all true. I let Aoi's murderer run free. And used the phantom thieves solely for my benefit. I'm just as rotten as those criminals. I don't have the right to lecture Akane. I never did to begin with. Save her? That's right, Zenkichi. Wake up! Maybe you did stuff your emotions away, but it was for your family's sake. You did it to protect Akane, the daughter you love. My mom was the same. She worked as hard as she could every day, doing what she believed was right. So stop blaming yourself. If you want to blame someone, blame those monsters that hurt your family. Yeah, don't lose sight of your target. Your devotion to your daughter is what matters. Torturing yourself over that would be a waste. Now look deep within your heart and find your way forward. Guys. Be strong, Senkichi. Please get back up. This is something only you can do. The real enemies are still out there. Bring them down for Akane-chan's sake. <sighs> You're right. The real threat is still out there. Those who ruin lives and tear families apart without a second thought. How stupid have I been? My own daughter tells me how to do my job. And then these kids start lecturing me? I may not be a hero, and I sure as hell don't deserve any awards. But at least I know what makes a person evil. Evil only cares about itself. It's the mark of a man who would bring another to ruin and dare not show remorse. I will never let people like that go free. And I'll give everything I have to bring them down! Pretend they do not see their agony. Just as you once did. 
but another story must begin. Now, show your jailers that you will wear a different chain. I am thou. Thou art I. If you yet seek true justice, we will see it done. Seal the contract. Uh. For real? I know what I have to do now. Condemn the evil and hunt them down! What the? What, what happened to my clothes? Oh, am I finally losing my marbles? Is that his phantom thief attire? And he has a persona! Waiting for. Get it! It comes, Zenkichi! Get ready! Ready? How? Yeah, never mind. Guess I'm just gonna wing it. Persona! Eljon! Yeah, get him, Gramps! Mess their shit up! He's amazing! He's moving like someone happy! How about you cut the wise cracks and let me do my thing? Cut the gun off you! Whoa! Grace could have held all decked out like this. Pretty sweet, I gotta say. Surrender! Strike the belt off! Come to me! Come forth! I'll go! Here! Of this! Of this! Of this! Persona! Put them down! This is my spirit rock for it! Let's try this. Here! Of this, here! Persona! Come to me! Come forth! Persona! This is my spirit rock forth! Persona! Listen to me, Akane. Those scumbags are feeding off your pain and that of other decent human beings. They drain the lives of those around them like parasites, all for their own petty convenience. So don't let them take advantage of you. You need to come home with me. After all this, you still won't see things my way. I won't believe you. I can't. With the power I have, I can finally change the bad people's hearts. If that bothers you, then come and get me. And fair warning, I'll change your heart before you even know it. Akane, don't go! She disappeared. Is she some sort of hologram? Ah, damn it! Are you guys alright? We are, but what about you? That outfit of yours... Belongs in a museum, I know. But forget about that. Let's get you out of there. Looks like it's electronically locked. Hold on, I'll get it open in a jiffy. Woo! Thanks, Oracle. I knew you'd come to our rescue! Of course! I'm so glad you're all okay! Hey, you can always count on me. We narrowly escaped a dark fate. Yeah, I thought I'd be stuck in a jail all over again. We heard you were arrested. You had us worried sick. Well, thanks to you, I got out. 
Gotta tip my hat to your older sister, too. Good going, sis. I knew you could do it. But damn, Gramps. I nearly dropped a brick when you showed up. Hey, I'm just as flabbergasted as you. And what's with the chained up knife thing? That's the rebel in your heart awakened. The power of your persona. A rebel, huh? Hey, fine by me. I don't understand a damn thing, but if it can help me fight, I'll take it. So, you guys know what this means. He needs an official code name. I do? Oh, right. Whenever you're in uniform, you always call each other something different. Hmm. Then go ahead and call me... Wolf. Those endless days of barking on command are done. From now on, lone wolf or not, my fangs will shred all evil. <laughs> I like the sound of that. Yeah, that totally puts it in perspective. You do look cool, Wolf. All right, then. Welcome to the Phantom Thieves. Uh, it's that simple, huh? Thanks. Good to be here. Not to change the subject, but I want to get back to Akane. And I'm gonna need everyone's... Uh, uh, help? Uh, Whoa! Gramps, you good? Uh, uh, damn. Uh, why the hell am I so exhausted? It's all part of the process of awakening your persona. It takes quite a toll on your psyche. We should head back to the real world and rest. No. I'll be fine. Akane comes first. Damn it. We can't fail this mission if we want to save Akane-chan's life. Let's come back when we're able to fight at our best. Uh, fine. Let's go. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> 